Hey, how's it going guys? Dalton here with another video on the YouTube channel and in today's Red Dead Redemption 2 video We're gonna be finding out what happens if you leave Guarma early and return to the mainland And Lemoyne going to see maybe go to Shady Bell to find out if the gang members are really there Or did Rockstar kind of just throw them in a different universe? We're gonna be doing that experiment today And I've been so excited to do this experiment to find out what happens if Arthur just returns to the mainland As he's supposed to still be on Guarma with Micah and Dutch and just seeing how Arthur would react to being in the U.S. instead of Guarma. This is going to be a really cool experiment. And nonetheless, I thought about what happens if I just leave the island by myself. Like, can I leave the island? So instead of doing like the little PC magic mod menu, I just wanted to find out, well, what happens if I just leave the island on my own instead of happily going using the mod menu? Because as you guys can see, we're wanted dead or alive. Live. And if you're actually in Guarma, you won't see like the USA map where like Le Moyne, you won't see Valentine, Strawberry, you know, San Denis, you won't see any of that. You'll just see the blank map of Guarma. So as you kind of get so far out to, you know, the middle of the ocean, you will notice that this is kind of the map that you see. So I was like, okay, well, let me see if I could just leave Guarma early. I wanted to find out what happens if I just get on a boat. No, the closer you go to like the ocean or leave the camp, like the closer you pass like a Donchwiz, which is actually Fusar's compound, you will actually get shot by invisible snipers. Now, for the love of me, I could not find those invisible snipers. So the game wants you to stay on Guarma and it prevents you from leaving and returning back to the mainland. So I said, okay, well that plan's not going to work. So we decided to use a mod menu instead. And to my surprise, I used my mod menu and went back to Valentine. And just seeing Arthur really sunny and sunburned is actually really weird because Arthur's like really sunburned compared to the rest of the, you know, NPCs and Valentine. I don't know why I decided to go back to Valentine. I just decided to do that. Uh, but you guys can just about see here. It looks kind of interesting just to kind of go back to Valentine and kind of talk to the strangers and kind of see what they're doing. And seeing a sunburned Arthur, you know, supposed to be on Guarma, but he's on the mainland. So everything kind of goes as normal here. You know, the NPCs are kind of still running around on wagons and, you know, able to talk to you. Now I wanted to find out what happens if I just return to Shady Bell. As you guys know, Shady Bell was the main camp that the gang was actually set to stay at as they wait to rob the San Denis Bank or even leave to a private island like Guarma. This was the last chapter that Arthur Morgan was actually stayed at, which was the Shady Bell Plantation House that all the gang members actually stayed at. I wanted to see if any of the gang members would be available here. And to my surprise, I came back. The whole place was just empty. I checked Abigail and John's room. I checked Dutch's room and Molly's and I even checked Arthur's room and that was completely empty so the gang kind of just took all of the supplies all of the beds blankets and etc and just left in a hurry so there was really no accompaniments or leftover provisions or anything that would let the gang or let the Pinkertons know the gang was actually here because they did a really good job at clearing it out like the only thing that were left were like a few logs and campfire you know Conuments like alcohol, beers, and soup, and stuff like that. So, I wanted to find out what happens if I just return to Lakay. As we know, Lakay is like the temporary um, safe house that Arthur actually stays at for a while before heading out to Beaver Hollow. I wanted to find out before we got to chapter six, I wanted to find out what happens if you just return back to the place that Arthur actually met the gang, which was Lakay. As we know, Strauss found out about it. Um, by people and Sadie and Adler. Sadie Adler and kind of cleared out all of the people living here, which she probably most likely killed them or sent them on their way. The story really doesn't give us kind of a main line of what exactly is going on here. But to my surprise, I came back to Luke and no, nobody was actually there. So it makes me wonder, Rockstar Games probably just put them in like a isolation where they're just not not available at this chapter who really knows but that's kind of what i thought 
Now I find out what happens if I just return to the Saint Denis Bank. And wouldn't you know the wall that we destroyed in that banking of the old American art, but banking, that mission, that wall we destroyed with Dutch to get out with our lives, that has been rebuilt and back to the original. So they did that pretty fast. I wonder if like a few weeks have went by on Guarma. Um, who really knows? As you guys can clearly see, I'm really not that far into the Guarma chapter. I'm just at the mission right before the gang just got introduced to um, Leon, which is kind of like the main gang master that wants to take down Fusar as well. Leon, and I believe the other one is Hercule. Yeah, him. He's kind of like, I'm just in the middle of the mission where I'm supposed to be going after the workers in the fields. So right after Dutch saves Javier. So I'm really kind of not that far into Guarma. So it could have been a couple weeks past before I actually arrived, which would tend to have the bank, you know, by then have this whole thing completely fixed and the only thing i wanted to try to see what happens if i go to lenny's and hosea's grave have they been buried yet wouldn't you know yes this location where hosea and lenny are actually buried have been you know revealed to have them be buried at the time of us as on guarma so you guys can clearly see lenny and you guys can just about see i am actually in chapter five you can see the only chapters i've completed is welcome to the new world and salvagery unreleased so you do know that i am indeed in guarma and we use kind of like a pc mod menu to get ourselves in here which is quite cool as you guys can see r.i.p lenny summers r.i.p hosea matthews we can still visit their graves on the time of being at guarma which is really sad to come back to when i was recording this last night i really felt bad coming back here because i really do miss hosea and lenny they were really good gang members at the time of them at the bank robbery just having hosea you know be there for arthur as a child it, it just it's just extremely sad um and then i decided to go what happens if i just start doing stranger missions and wouldn't you know you can actually do this so i honestly believe rockstar games just didn't intend anybody to leave guarma due to those invisible snipers but nonetheless you can actually do stranger missions i did like the brothers help and all where you help brother darkens and you can clearly see and I don't know why I decided to do this either going to the sanity doctor because it's not like he's going to remember or recognize us as we haven't visited him yet to be diagnosed for Arthur's tuberculosis so he wouldn't have known but you know maybe I would get some kind of income or dialogue that he would know that we would have tuberculosis early nope he didn't really have anything much too satisfying to say so that kind of just kind of shows you just how cool this experiment actually is and that is what happens when you actually leave guarma early and visit the gang members or even come back to the u.s like lemoyne strawberry valentine saint denis you know the original area that you're supposed to be at and nope the gang members are nowhere to be found i've looked everywhere and the gang members will not be found so i believe that rockstar games kind of just isolated them into uh, out of the map until we return back to guarma so pretty much they're just not available during this chapter is what i think rockstar games would have done in that instance but anyway guys that is all the information i got for you guys on this video today if you guys did enjoy don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily awesome videos such as gta 6 videos gta 5 and rockstar games videos and all the upcoming red dead redemption 2 videos that i'll be doing on my channel and let me know in the comments down below do you guys got any other experiments you would like me to look at in uh, red dead redemption 2 you got any other secrets mysteries that we haven't covered yet you guys can let me know in the comments down below and wait you know what you can actually still get a haircut too which i kind of think is pretty funny that arthur can actually get a haircut in this sunny burnt version but i would love to hear from you guys in the comments down below if you guys have got any other mysteries and secrets that we can explore let me know down there but like i said guys stay happy healthy and well and i'll see you guys all later on the next video